at six, the Bahamas has reported 49 new COVID-19 cases since opening its borders to foreign travelers on July 1st. Officials there say that is enough of a spike in a small nation to cause a major worry. CBS 4's Hank Tester reports Bahamian borders will soon be closed to most American tourists. So close, now so far away, the Bahamas. Thanks to coronavirus and the big spike in the U.S., our island neighbors to the east closing borders to most U.S. travelers. That means you cannot fly American Airlines, JetBlue, uh, Southwest to the Bahamas if you're coming from the United States. Bahamas Air, the air bridge to the Bahamas, operation suspended right now. No agents at Miami International Airport. And this from the government of the Bahamas. But to close down commercial travel, that has just been a blow to all of us within the tourism industry. But, you know, the uptick in COVID cases in the Bahamas, knowing what our facilities are, what we're able to manage, I think the government had to make the decision that it did just in the best interest of everyone. The Bahamas had just reopened to tourists on July the 1st. And since then, they've had an increase in cases, worrisome for a small country. And that's the, the problem facing most of the Caribbean. You know, you don't have a huge number of ICU beds. You know, these are very small countries. You know, the Bahamas is a very small population. There's a large surface area, um, but it's a very small population. Um, and so it's just a risk that these countries can't afford to take. That shuts off major tourist trade to downtown Nassau. The government also has announced full suspension of beaches and restaurant service on Grand Bahama, where most of the cases have appeared. But you can still get there from here. U.S. citizens can sail their boats to the island, and you can take charter flights to most of the islands. Folks can still get to those condos on Bimini. If you're a boater, if you're taking a pleasure craft, taking your own boat, you can still do that. However, anyone who's coming to the Bahamas has to show proof of a COVID negative test taken within 10 days of their trip. Bahamas Air will offer one flight a day out of Fort Lauderdale to the Bahamas for Bahamians who want to return home. That'll go through Wednesday. Call the airline for information. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News.